on war. In this webinar, we will try to explain why and how it exists and what can we do. Our current world system is based on money. Consequently, the dark forces manipulate the people and their leaders through money and power. The dark forces want and thus start wars, but they must have the willing participation of the people. Wars are systematically planned and budgeted years before they start. Even the number of casualties are planned. The mainstream media is used to get people involved. The dark forces position themselves to make a profit in times of peace as well as in war. In times of peace they manipulate the economy and the markets to their advantage. Once the economy falls into depression, the dark forces use war to revive the depressed economy and make even more money. In fact, the war machine is the best profit-making enterprise in the present world system. War preoccupies humanity with survival, while economic manipulations done prior to the war fall aside. To summarize, war is a racket. War has nothing to do with protecting your country from an enemy. Both sides of a war are creations of the dark forces. For war brings the dark forces huge fortunes while the people shoulder the bill of death mangled bodies, shattered minds, economic instability, taxation for generations, etc. Slowly, humanity is realizing that war is not the solution and that it only makes life worse. This realization is beginning to create strong resistance to war and is slowly growing in the hearts of people all around the world. This urge for peace needs to be nurtured and supported. The spiritual hierarchy offers the needed support from on high, but peace-loving people must invoke this support. All can use the following invocation to blunt the use of war on our planet. We invoke the help of Saint Germain and the Masters and Lady Masters of the spiritual hierarchy, of Jesus the Christ and the Buddha, of our planetary Logos, Sanat Kumara. As well we invoke the help of the great beings from beyond our planet who may be working with the lords of the earth at this time to assist in the great spiritual evolution before us. We come before you asking for your heavenly help in eradicating war from our planet. Let all world leaders who are inclined to war, torture and all forms of such evil doing and who collaborate with those dark forces that up to this point have controlled the money and the power on this planet, let these leaders be given a choice. Send angels to say to them, you who had the country, be aware. If you continue to be in the camp of these dark ones, who would war and take and lie and kill, you shall go quickly down with them. If you have the heart and mind to see that this is not the way of light, love and joy, 
and have the courage to change, to do something of true worth for your country, then you will be a leader. Otherwise, prepare to lose all that you have. Let now the avalanche of karma be released upon all those who will not change their hard-hearted attitudes. Let now the lords of karma move mightily and swiftly and stop those who would perpetrate only further warfare and manipulations of this population. May the great and holy Master Saint Germain, the Lord of Freedom for the Earth, hurl his mighty miracle pouch into the governments of every single country that exists and consume with the violet flame all that is unrighteous. We demand that all world leaders be brought to account this very hour, that they all be held accountable for every war they have ever instigated simply to generate money. For the Lord of Righteousness is demanding explanation for their evil deeds and actions. We demand justice now. Let God's will be done in all matters. Let these things occur now and forevermore until our planet is as it was always meant to be, a garden of beauty, a place of love, light and joy, so that Earth might join her sisters and brothers in the cosmic parade of planets liberated. Let God's will be done. May the lords of karma answer our call and once and for all bring us back to love, love, love and love. So be it forevermore. Amen. Said with an audible and forceful voice, righteous sound can be as or more powerful than the pen. We invite you to sound the voice of the righteous. Thank you for watching. Thank you.